Alrighty, happy Wednesday afternoon. Your full weather forecast brought to you by Scott's Recreation, New England's largest trailer dealer, home of Maine's lowest camper and tractor prices. With locations in Turner, Manchester, Herman, and Orono, Maine. Alrighty, as we continue things this afternoon, everything's kind of tracked off towards the east. Still holding on a little bit of cloud cover this afternoon as well. But that will give way to some sunshine before it sets. But then our next system, located right about in here, is going to be tracking off towards the east. And that will give us good opportunities for showers and thunderstorms. So I'll have to keep an eye on that. Some heavy downpours will for sure be possible as well. Let's talk about the tropics right now. We have our eye on Hurricane Fiona right now. This thing is really getting its act together quickly as a Category 4 monster hurricane with winds that are really getting strong out there, up to around 130 miles per hour. Moving to the north at about 8 miles per hour. Notice Bermuda now under tropical storm warnings as this thing does continue to develop. The path has changed a little bit off toward the west, so the center of it may not cause much issues, though. But still, it's going to be close enough where it's going to get some of the effects from the system. And, of course, we're maintaining that Category 4 strength. And moving farther off towards the north as well before we going extra tropical. But some wave height issues could be possible in our backyard, too, throughout the next few days. So I'll have to watch that closely as the tracks off towards the north in a few areas. But moving forward, though, overall, the winds could get a little gusty from time to time in our backyard. But that will be more sure an issue for tomorrow with some gusts getting up to around 20 to 25 miles per hour. The winds today and tonight will not be a huge deal at all. Our average high is 69 degrees. We'll be in the upper 60s today and middle 60s as we head towards your Thursday. Cooling off Friday in the middle 50s, back in the 60s again as we head towards Saturday, Sunday, Monday, and even into your Tuesday as well. Future counts moving forward, these clouds will be slow to get out of here. We'll get a little bit of a break before our next system starts to approach with more showers and thunderstorms. Possible for a few of us and heavy downpours can't be ruled out either. The good news is it gets out of here by Thursday evening and things start to calm down. But these pesky clouds will be slow to get out of here. So things will remain a little dreary as we head towards your Friday. So how much rain could we, could we see? Maybe up to one to two inches in some areas before we're all finished up with lesser amounts further off towards the north and west. So that forecast for today, upper 60s, mostly cloudy, some sun coming out late. The northwest wind getting out to about 5 to 10 miles per hour. Later on side, lower 50s, a few showers and thunderstorms possible late. The south wind getting up to about 5 to 10 miles per hour. For tomorrow, middle 60s, showers and thunderstorms likely, some heavy downpours possible. With that gusty south wind up to about around 20 miles per hour. Already that Scott's Recreation extended forecast, mostly cloudy on Friday, with highs falling into the middle 50s. Lower 60s on Saturday with a partly cloudy sky. And upper 60s on Sunday will remain partly cloudy.